Napoli coach Walter Mazzari is keen for his team to end the season on the best possible note, despite making sure they will be playing in the UEFA Champions League next season. A 3-0 victory over Bologna on Wednesday guaranteed the club second in Serie A. And whilst Mazzari is proud of that fact, he has another milestone in his sights. Yes, I agree. A great game. But we still have two other games left to play. If you look at the statistics, if you manage to win the last two games, we could even break Maradona's record for points gained. I personally haven't gained so many points in my whole career before, and I would like to try and give my guys a further motivation to make them close the season as high as they can. The team that denied Napoli a first Scudetto since 1990 had an even more eventful night. Juventus's match against Atalanta was suspended for 10 minutes as rival fans threw flares at one another, with coach Antonio Conte trying to calm supporters down amid worrying scenes. Juve won the match 1-0, but match winner Alessandro Matri made his feelings on the incident clear. Similar accidents should not happen in stadiums. I don't know why it happened. These are things that shouldn't be seen, and maybe it's better not to give them importance talking about them. Meanwhile, Milan strengthened their position in the final UEFA Champions League spot with a comprehensive 4-0 win over Pescara. Mercurial striker Mario Balotelli scoring a brace. Milan assistant coach Mauro Tussotti had nothing but praise for the side. We opened the game well straight away with the first goal and then it became quite easy. It was important to start well and we managed it. It has been a season to forget for City rivals Inter though. A 3-1 reverse to Lazio means that for the first time in 14 years there will not be a European competition next season.